there's this thing that they made on the powder toy called Landscape with Military Base. I think it, that's what it says. My, by Longbow 1612. And I, he like thought of a video. Okay, yeah. I actually just it. Okay, so I actually thought of video ideas. And um, one of them was seeing the ruins of certain devastating events. Guess what I'm doing. Okay, first event, lightning. So this is like more realistic thunder, as the game states. And it is very much more realistic. This is not at all realistic. But it's still more realistic than the thunder, let's be real. Okay, so basically once it adjusts, there is ended entirely. We'll just see what the ruins of it look like. That is surprisingly slow. And then they have an emergency sprinkler system. Because they aren't stupid. Boom. That was actually not that bad. Okay. Let's just act like the virus has turned into an, a particle. Like, it's not just like tiny little viruses. You can see it now. And it infects anything, not only humans. You know which virus I'm talking about. Unless you live under a rock like Patrick Stark. Okay, let's just say that the virus doesn't have aerial attacks yet. So that's the ruins of a virus. What else? Liquid op oxygen. Nope, no, 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 no virus. Okay, liquid oxygen and fire are what I'm doing next. Uh, uh, okay, the sun is too much. You know what I'm trying? I'm trying mercury. Because this thing is sort of bad, I guess. I don't know. Mercury plus thunder. Just a tiny bit of thunder so that I can, like, spark it. Boom. You know, I think most of the damage is going to be that thunder part. Oh, God. Imagine being in that elevator. Just being zapped, in, like, every three nanoseconds. Like, bzz, bzz. Let me give you a closer work of look of Mr. Elevator. He's not looking too good. Oops, I just put thunder everywhere. <coughs> okay, so there's the ruins of Mercury and okay, let's see what else. What about, oh my god, how does the sun get this place so hot? I gotta cool it all down. You know what, I'm cooling down the sun. You know what, I'll give it a warm up for what's gonna come soon. Deuterium, I mean deuterium. Hang on, I have an idea. Yeah, about the sun, guys. And the pressure situation. Imagine just hearing nukes upstairs and you're like, I wonder what's going on. And then you just continue to sleep. 
And you hear distant screams coming from, like, um, uh, I don't know, over there. And then you're like, okay, uh, that's, 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 that's very normal. Imagine just hearing screams from here. And then you're like, yeah, that's normal. And then you get up from your bed and there's just fire everywhere. What else can I do? Mix particles around randomly. Oh no, wait, I just made this look a tiny bit more realistic instead of making it just trash. Okay, hang on, then I have an idea. Why don't I fill our entire base with liquid rubdam? How was that pronounced again? Okay. Do not act like it's rain time, guys. There's clouds all up in the sky. Rubdium on the ground. What can possibly go wrong? Everything can. So that's why I'm gonna put lots of, lots of, lots of clouds, clouds everywhere. Yeah, that was bound to rain on Sunday. Somebody put that one calamity music from Terraria. I'm just gonna fill our base up with clouds. You know that the situation is bad about your clouds when the sun in the, is losing a battle against the clouds. And your entire military base blew up. And the sun is now a cloud. <clears throat> I also thought of another idea. Mr. Man here wants to declare war. So he brought his golden armor. Oh my god, my brush is so big. I hate mobile powder tool. Mobile parlor toy is so trash. You know what? Whatever. Mr. Man is a tiny, giant little blob over here. Okay, that's Mr. Man. And he has his armor. Now he wants to kill these guys. How will he do it? So he's gonna try wood. Just throughout their entire whole base. And it's connected all the way to the sun. And that should inevitably burn everything. Okay, his armor is standing up to it. Okay, that was nice. His potato PC. On his potato PC, he's using the McDonald's Wi-Fi from the McDonald's right next to him to play Fortnite.
he decided to stop playing Fortnite and add a little bit more of layers to his armor. Because, you know, he definitely needed that. And he can see through almost all of his armor. So that's good. And then he'll have a little shieldy thingy. It's made of glass. So those are his new upgrades. So he decided to smush in some titanium, quartz, and ceramic, and iron, and colloids. If you watch Spike Viper, you'd know why I put colloids in there. Keep in mind, you can see through all of that except for the shield part. And for shield, we'll just do some glass. And then, think it's a shield. Like, just everywhere, everywhere, everywhere. Boom. Okay. What has he planned? Okay. He's doing something about thermite. Oh, no. This would also be like, this would also, this would also be like, that's maybe he's trying to see what he can withstand. Okay, his glass is so far not that working that well. But the ceramic will probably absorb all of that heat and just use it as pressure and use it as stronger. Okay, so far going so good because of all that plasma. We decided that he has been able to make his armor a little better. He's going to be invincible is what he says. And Mr. Man will have a nice glass shield. So his armor takes up a lot less space now. So he decided to put noble gas everywhere. And by everywhere, I mean everywhere. And there's electricity. And that all turned it all into plasma. You know, life is bad when the sun is made of plasma. Wait. That sounds very normal. Okay, his armor is withstanding. Come on, Mr. Man. He decided to put a lot more noble gas. What is he doing now? He's gonna kill himself with all this thunder. But okay. Good try, Mr. Man, but you're gonna kill yourself. You're gonna kill yourself. No! I'll make a tiny little dot to indicate Mr. Man. And I'll fill that with wood. Just to show how fragile his freaking body is. Okay. Okay, yeah, that's absorbing it. What was that? Gold. Yeah, that's absorbing it. Oh, that's very hot, really. So as he d sits down, um, uh, enjoys the coffee he prepared, he decides to put fireworks. Just a happy Doomsday celebration. Pretty cool, right? I'm pretty sure that's what normal people do.
Okay, that plutonium already is going to get very, very high pressure. So I don't know if you should, should try that, Mr. Man. Because your gold shield is gone. And your nukes are exploding. <laughs> Mr. Man is going overboard. Yeah, he still does it. Steam. Okay, liquid rub, dim. He's gonna die. What's this event? Yeah, sure, that definitely save you. Oh no, something broke most of his armor. The vent isn't working that much anymore. Well, he has a little bit of stuff left. He and he has to use it quick. Diamond. Okay, the lag was preventing me. He quickly puts water in a hurry. I stated quickly twice. He's sort of on fire, but he's okay. Just a measly 10,000 degrees. So I'm just joking. He's 1,000 degrees Celsius. You gotta save him from burning entirely. Honestly, I think 3,000 degrees. He's Celsius lava is gonna be he, a tiny bit of wood. And then he has an idea. He can use his magic eraser gun. Boom, save. Diamond protection. But then he's on fire again. No, no, no. Hang on. How did that happen? That should have happened. No, oh God. It's off of this entire place. Is like water right now. Okay, he's cloning himself a little bit. And by a little bit, I mean like most of his armor. The heat is transferring through the diamonds? Oh no. But then all of a sudden they start to fight back. Mr. Man is sad. Mr. Man uses destructive bombs. Mr. Man is dying. What's here his final words? I am not, um, I, I'm not even a boy. Those were his last words. He's stupid. His name is literally Mr. Man. What else would you expect? For him to be a girl? I can play that music actually. Hang on. Okay, I'll just play it.
I'm gonna do a Minecraft manhunt. Dreams, dreams everywhere. Of course that's gonna be the texture pack I put on there. Why would it be? I made this texture pack. It's trash, guys. I, you guys should be happy you can't get it. Oh okay, yeah, I forgot about it. What is this seed? A cut off tree, a cave pool that you literally spawn inside of, and then rose bushes. Hmm, no friends are online. I can change that. Try and get me! Try and get me! Try and get me! Try and get me! Oh my god, that spawn was so weird. I want to get the heck away from there before it's too late. Yoshi, save me. Save me from this hideous stuff. Also, we get a lot of five lives because I'm trash at Minecraft. Cool. Try and get me. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. New to our wow. Oh, now I cannot feel. Oh, I just still see the name tag. And now the cloud thing. gets louder when I'm on grouching. Mm -hmm. You are allowed to look at my screen, that's cheating. Mm -hmm. oh, I'm not doing scene toilet. I'll just do boss too. I'll just hum. No way, a jungle. Mm -hmm. This was a pretty mm -hmm. You lost a lot. Mm -hmm. Wait, mm -hmm. and also lost. No, mm -hmm. also lost. Mm -hmm. That's the pack. Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. the pack is mm -hmm. Pikachu. Yep. Mm -hmm. You know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why? Okay. I don't know. Just because I was one of the things I cared for. Mm -hmm. You could be looking for my name tag right now. Well, just invisible anyways. I'm not crouching. Like, bro, are you seriously that far away from me, lol? Bro, you're out of village? Lol, alright. You aren't gonna, you aren't close to finding me, you aren't gonna find me. Well, you're out of Tiger Bomb, that's right next to my jungle, I'm pretty sure. I wonder what side it is. Okay. Um, uh, so you should be able to be knowing where I am, but not exactly. So, um, uh, every, like, few minutes, I'll tell you my chords. 
but not the Y coordinate, okay? Yeah. Okay, I'll only tell you one specific coordinate. So this time I'll tell you only my X coordinate. 304. Oh, I have my long gray to go. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna tell you another coordinate. Oh, yeah, I have a long way to go. <laughs> yeah, you have 400 blocks. Do you just kill your stove? Then go a little bit far away from the spawn. The jungle is actually very close. Okay, I'll tell you my Y coordinate, the most pointless one ever. Don't tell me that. 70. Why did you tell me the most? I have a stack of melons. Wow. That's a lot of melons. Ooh, and bamboo. Let's go. Okay, there's bamboo here. I don't really care. Wheat. Okay, no more wheat seeds, I guess. Okay, I'll tell you a random coordinate. Okay? Okay. I'm not going to tell you which one this is this time. So you may as well go to 420, 420, But that'd be stupid of you to do. What? Wait, 420 is above the build limit, though. Okay, it's definitely not the Y cord, though. Okay, that's all you know. Yeah. Plus, why would I, like, literally make it so obvious that I'm cheating? Wouldn't I at least keep it a secret? I'm so trash at Minecraft. I only have, like, leather ar I only have leather armor and a stone sword and an iron pickaxe. Like, that's so stupidly dumb. That's absurd. Why? What? Okay, I'm gonna go to I'm gonna some diamonds. <gasps> Never mind, sweet berry bushes everywhere. I'm getting jam packed with food. The foxy eye is so weird. Hey, mm, okay, hang on, wait a few seconds. Because I'm looking for a random place for a random coordinate, okay? Makes sense, right? Because yeah. if you want a random coordinate, you need a, you need a place first. Also, I managed to get two stacks of watermelons and sweet berries. I'm finding lots of watermelon. It's like soy. Dude, what? you're in the jungle now. Okay, so one of my, I'll tell you a random chord. Negative two hundred and thirty-nine. Yo, hang on. Okay, um, uh, I just crafted a shovel. Oh, never mind. I thought I did. I forgot I didn't. Okay.
I'm just going to be mining in down to Y coordinate 12 with my, my pickaxe then. Well, if I die. Cool, cool. Hang on. Okay. Yo, this is so much coal. Mm -hmm. Let's pause.